Hey guys, how's it going? Greek Otaku here, and today I wanted to review Scooby Doo. Scooby Dooby Doo, where are you? We got some work to do now. Wait a minute. That's not what I wanted to talk about. Um. Oh, okay, here, let me start over. Hey guys, how's it going? Greek Otaku here, and today I wanted to review Ghost Hunt. <laughs> this 25 episode series is directed by Ray Mono, produced by JC Staff, and licensed by Funimation Entertainment. The original runtime was October 7th, 2006 to March 27, 2007. In simple terms, the plot of this anime is to uncover the darkest mysteries of the unseen. And the characters in this show are Mei Taniyama, Kazuya Shibuya, also known as Naru because he's a narcissist. There is a TV star spirit medium known as Masuko Hara, a shrine maiden known as Ayako, an exorcist named John Brown from Australia, and a monk slash rock star named Takigawa. Let's also not forget Naru's assistant, Lin Kojo. Let's just say that all the professionalism lies within Lin. Um, here's some examples as to why I think that. In Maiden, the principal wasn't sold on you, so he called me to drive the spirits out. I was under the impression that only innocent virgins can become Shrine Maiden. Express how excited I am to join you. Mr. Brown is relatively new to our country, so please show him the respect he deserves. <laughs> no, no, let me guess. You're looking for a playground, right? You got it! What's wrong with her? Did she hit her head when she fainted and turn into a crazy person? She's become possessed. So there's one part in the series where we get to hear the story of May's life. And who's been taking care of you all this time? Oh, well I had a teacher that was really nice and she let me come and stay over at her house for a while. The what? She's Matilda? Okay, if you don't know who Matilda is, let me just show you this really super sped up clip to show you who she is. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't, I don't even know, I don't even know what to say to that, it's the most annoying person in the show. Her name is Kuroda, the most annoying girl in the series. I wanted to punch her in the face like 52 times throughout the first three episodes. I was like, I can't. Three episodes, there's a different file, they finally solved the case. It reminds me a lot of Scooby-Doo, as you've seen in my intro. It reminds me a lot of Scooby-Doo. I like it, but I tried watching it again and could not bring myself to watch it again. I, I couldn't get past the third episode. I got to the second episode and then it was like, alright, episode three, and I was like, no. Kino's Journey. Not, not third episode. I'd rather, I'd rather watch something that I was I haven't seen it before. In all of the realness, though, this anime is pretty good. I wouldn't call it the most beautiful thing in the world. It's probably like a... Um, I'd give it a 50%. 50% on my most loved anime. It's rating scale. 5 out of 10. If you haven't seen it, I suggest you give the first couple of episodes a try, and if you like it from there, good on you, man. Keep going. You've got 23 episodes left if you give it two episodes. So, actually, you have to give it three episodes because that that first file takes three episodes to solve. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see y'all later. Bye.